Engineering law is the study of the application of laws in engineering. The application of laws means the study of how ethics and legal frameworks should be adopted to ensure public safety surrounding the practice of engineering. California law defines engineering as the professional practice of rendering service or creative work requiring education, training and experience in engineering sciences and the application of special knowledge of the mathematical, physical and engineering sciences in such professional or creative work as consultation, investigation, evaluation, planning or design of public or private utilities, structures, machines, processes, circuits, buildings, equipment or projects, and supervision of construction for the purpose of securing compliance with specifications and design for any such work. Topic. Graduate attributes and professional competencies The requirements from the perspective of the Washington Accord are for engineering graduates to attain the following knowledge and skill. WA6. Apply reasoning informed by contextual knowledge to assess societal, health, safety, legal and cultural issues and the consequent responsibilities relevant to professional engineering practice and solutions to complex engineering problems. In North America it is common to have four years of professional experience before being licensed as an engineer. Topic. Subtopics Key topic areas for engineering law are Ethics, professional misconduct and negligent practice Tort law is integral to assigning blame and penalties after engineering failures Contract law is the promissory basis for the vast majority of engineering projects Product liability, especially for manufactured products. Intellectual property protection, which includes patents, copyrights, trade secrets and integrated circuit topographies. Safety legislation codes, and regulations, which includes plant safety, risk management, food safety. Standards and certification, which can be product or system-specific constraints on design and testing processes often imposed for health and safety reasons. The practice of engineering is largely separated from the practice of science by engineering law. A physicist and an electrical engineer, practicing at a large company are mainly differentiated by the laws they are practicing under and the license they carry. Topic. Specific engineering laws In the United States of America and Canada engineering is governed by state or provincial law. In New York engineers are governed by Article 145 of the Education Law. Pennsylvania has the Engineer, Land Surveyor and Geologist Registration Law. Act of May 23, 1945 PL 913, No. 367 CL 63. Vermont Title 26 Professions and Occupations Chapter 20 Professional Engineering. New Hampshire Section 310A. Massachusetts MGL. Chapter 112, Sections 81D to 81T, MGL. Chapter 112 Sections 61 to 65E and 250 CMR5 Professional Practice Michigan Law Regulating and Licensing Engineering is under Article 20 of Public Act 299 of 1980 Illinois Statutes lists professions occupations and business operations 225 ILCS 325 Professional Engineering Practice Act of 1989 Main General Provisions 32 MRSA Section 1251 at SEQ State Board of Licensure 32 MRSA Section 1301 at SEQ Licensure 32 MRSA Section 1351 at SEQ 
Wyoming Title 33 Professions and Occupations, Chapter 29 Surveyors and Engineers. Florida Administrative Code Chapter 61G15 Board of Professional Engineers Organization, Florida Statutes Chapter 471 Engineering, Chapter 455 Professional Regulation. Ontario passed the Professional Engineers Act, RSO. 1990, Chapter 28 and RRO. Regulation 941, General. Alberta Engineering and Geosciences Act, Revised Statutes of Alberta 2000 Chapter E11. California Professional Engineers Act, Business and Professions Code, 6700-6799, Chapter 7. Arkansas lists the Engineer Law, A.C.A. Section 17-30-101 at SEQ with amendments from 2013 Legislative Session. New Brunswick Chapter 9, Engineering and Geoscience Professions Act, assented to June 5, 2015. Washington Chapter 18.43 RCW Engineers and Land Surveyors. Alaska Statutes Title 8 Chapter 48. Architects, Engineers, Land Surveyors, and Landscape Architects. 2010 Georgia Code Title 43 Professions and Businesses Chapter 15 Professional Engineers and Land Surveyors. The State of Texas Title 6 Subtitle A Chapter 1001 Engineering Practice Act and Rules Concerning the Practice of Engineering and Professional Licensure. Saskatchewan Chapter E 9.3 of the Statutes of Saskatchewan, 1996, effective March 7, 1997, as amended by the Statutes of Saskatchewan, 1997, C. S. 6.01, 2000, C.43, 2009, C. T. 23.01, 2010, C. B. 12 and C.19 and 20, 2013, C. C21.1, 2014, CE13.1, and 2018, C.42, the Engineering and Geoscience Professions Act. Manitoba CCSMC. E120, the Engineering and Geoscientific Professions Act. Idaho Engineers and Surveyors Idaho Code, Title 54, Chapter 12. New Jersey State Board of Professional Engineers and Land Surveyors Law Wisconsin Statutes Chapter 443 Examining Board of Architects, Landscape Architects, Professional Engineers, Designers, and Professional Land Surveyors Nova Scotia Engineering Profession Act Chapter 148 of the Revised Statutes, 1989 Amended 2006 c. 29, 2008, c. 15, 2009, c. 13, 2010, c. 15. Prince Edward Island E08-1 Engineering Profession Act Maryland Title 14 Business Occupations and Professions Professional Engineers Connecticut Chapter 391 Section 20-299-20-310 -20 Professional Engineers and Land Surveyors Delaware Title 24 Professions and Occupations Chapter 28 Professional Engineers Virginia Regulations Governing Architects, Professional Engineers, Land Surveyors, Certified Interior Designers and Landscape Architects, Statutes Title 54.1, Chapter 4 Excerpts from Title 13.1 West Virginia Code Chapter 30 Professions and Occupations Article 13 Engineers North Carolina General Statutes of North Carolina Chapter 89C Engineering and Land Surveying South Carolina Chapter 22 Engineers and Surveyors, Chapter 49 Department of Labor, Licensing and Regulation South Carolina State Board of Registration for Professional Engineers and Land Surveyors Alabama Law Regulating Practice of Engineering and Land Surveying, Code of Alabama 1975 Title 34, Chapter 11 
Mississippi Code of 1972, Title 73 Professions and Vocations Chapter 13 Engineers and Land Surveyors British Columbia Engineers and Geoscientists Act RSBC 1996, Chapter 116 Quebec Chapter 19 Engineers Act Newfoundland Statutes of Newfoundland and Labrador 2008 Chapter E 12.1 An Act Respecting the Practice of Engineering and Geoscience Louisiana Laws, Revised Statutes, Title 37, Chapter 8 Professional Engineering and Professional Surveying State of Oklahoma Statutes Regulating Professional Engineering and Land Surveying, 475 It is illegal for a practicing engineer to jeopardize public safety in any way. This means that an engineer must hold herself or himself to the highest level of moral conduct or suffer litigation if an engineering system fails causing harm to the public or to a maintenance technician. Breaches of engineering law are often sufficient grounds for enforcement measures, which may include the suspension or loss of license and financial penalties. It could also result in serving jail time, should gross negligence be shown to have played a part in any incident that caused loss of human life. Under circumstances where gross negligence has been proven, an engineering firm may no longer be considered to be vicariously liable for an individual engineer's gross negligence. In certain jurisdictions engineering laws are weak. The following countries have weak laws surrounding engineering. The United Kingdom where only specific safety-related tasks require a registered engineer. France is not a member of the Washington Accord. The practice of engineering is neither controlled nor regulated by French law. Weak engineering law can cause a variety of problems regarding public safety. The engineering profession was developed, in North America, to prevent certain problems and behaviors observed in the application of science in the public interest. Topic. The seal or stamp Many jurisdictions' engineering regulatory bodies require the use of a seal or stamp for all documentation for an engineering customer. The engineer sealing or stamping the engineering analysis or drawing must be in control of the engineering work. The sealed or stamped analysis or drawing must be up to the standard of a competent engineer and can be relied on as intended. A sealed or stamped engineering work is often considered to be the controlled copy of the work. It does not matter whether or not the customer asked for the seal or stamp. The analysis or drawing must be sealed or stamped if it is an engineering work. Internal analysis or drawings within a corporation or a partnership do not need to be sealed or stamped although they may be sealed or stamped at the engineer or organization's discretion. Topic. International engineering law In an international engineering project there may be a country where the work is originated and a country where the work is executed. The laws of both the originating country and the project destination country must be observed. Further complications may occur when the country where the engineering work is reviewed and approved is not the country where the work is originated or executed. In this case, a high ethical standard must be observed where all relevant laws are applied. In contract law, the contract law where the contract was signed is generally observed. Topic. Order to engineering Engineering must be conducted in an orderly and ethical manner. Any disorder involved in engineering practice could be termed as hacking and may endanger the public's trust in the way that engineering is practiced. Engineers must conduct themselves in a dignified manner and their work must reflect this dignity and dedication to excellence. Topic. See also Remote laboratory Engineering disasters 
Engineering Management Environmental Engineering Law Entertainment Law Law 